So this is Sphero. Sphero is a robotic gaming system that we've built and the game that we're showing here is an augmented reality game called Sharky the Beaver. And this is a little beaver, so instead of seeing Sphero on the ground, you now see a 3D image. And you can drive, you can drive Sharky around. Bluetooth connection, so you have up to 33 feet, but we've, uh, we've got about 50 feet just fine. So you can, you can play in your living room, you can play outside in your garden, you can play in a park. Um, and this basically just allows you to have a mobile gaming experience. If you tip the screen this way, you can actually play different challenges. So this says 10 cupcakes in 40 seconds. So we've built into this gaming system the ability to play um, with a 3D animated character, but you see your own environment. So that's the beauty of augmented reality. Okay. So now in addition to doing uh, games like this, where you're sort of an uh, augmented reality game, you can also use the Sphere as a controller to play other kinds of games. So this is our Neon Cat app that we built with the Pop-Tart Cat. It's an internet meme um, that's very popular. And what I'm doing is I have the ability to tip left to tip right, to move up the screen and back. And then also this element of tilting and tipping the front of the character to actually shoot. So this is something that you don't get with your traditional iPhone or Android phone experience um, because you only have two access inside of your phone. So this just really allows for enhanced gameplay. Also, you don't have to be touching your screen. You can just set your iPad up on a little dock and you can enjoy a new way to have mobile gaming. Okay, so now a couple of other uh, final questions. Uh, one, um, I want you to reproduce something I saw you do before, which is, so if I had this game, I would worry, I'm going to drop Sphero and I'm going to break him. Am I, should I be worried about that? No, we have a very extensive drop test, so I can drop him, and he's just fine. Um, You're scaring me. <laughs> we drop him 30 times from 30 feet. Very robust uh, robot inside a ball. Hackable, programmable, we have an SDK and an open API. So we have developers from all over the world developing games for Sphero that we then take and refine and build into our app suite if we love them enough. We just actually had a, a Kickstarter campaign uh, from a third party developer raise $10,000 to build a game for Sphero, which is really exciting. So um, how much is it? $129. Which you can buy where or when? Apple, Amazon, Brookstone, Barnes & Noble, and Target. Now. I can buy it now. Now. And how many games are there available, and where do I get the games? 20 plus games, uh, Google Play and iTunes Store, and only two of them are for sale right now, and they're 99 cents. So meaning the rest are free. Oh, so there's, there's more games, but there's only two that you have to pay for. Exactly. So 20 plus are free, and then two that are paid for, which is our Neon Cat and the augmented reality game. And then the last thing is we've been using an iPad here. Um, but you can also use iPhone, Android? Yes, so you can use uh, iPod Touch, Android uh, phone, iPhone, and also iPad.